Hey there, so many skills, so many perks, and it's so confusing which one to choose. Man, well, you got two skill sets, ambusher or stalker, and I'm going to show you which three stalker skills are the best skills for you to use in Hunter Call of the Wild 2023. So if this video helps you out, drop a thumbs up in the comment section and if you already knew what to do, tell me how you figured it out. Okay. Alright, so the first thing we're going to start off with is the skills, okay? So you got two types of skills, stalker and ambusher, okay? So the first skill is locate tracks. Now this is important when you're... Um, tracking an animal either if you shot the animal or if you just saw the tracks okay so the level the first level gives you the directional tracking cone becomes more accurate and narrow both in the world and on the map meaning you see it while you walking down the walking following the tracks and once you look on the map you'll see uh, the directional cone also and level two increases distance at which tracks are visible and highlighted level three the directional cone is now even more narrower and the tracks can be detected even fast farther away okay the second one is track knowledge you need track knowledge level one on track knowledge uh, reveals information about an animal's gender when investigating footprints and vocalization okay so once you you see the footprint you will um, and you, you you hit that investigate um, tab you will see more information about the animal okay when you hear the animal cry out and you hit that investigate tab you'll see more information about that animal uh, in the in the uh, box on the top right hand of your screen level two reveals more information about approximate animal group size when the investigating when investigating need zones tracks and animal approximate health when investigating blood trails okay level three reveals information about an animal's approximate weight when investigating footprints and fur type when investigating disturbed vegetation okay the third one i didn't put anything on this um i'm only happy when it rains this decreases your visibility in foggy weather um i should have put one on it but i did not uh, decrease uh, level two decreases your visibility in rainy weather all right it's not that important is to me. connect the dots now each time a track is investigated a trail line is automatically drawn on your hunter mate between tracks and of the active trail um, that means the animal you are tracking um, Trail direction is also indicated with an arrow, okay? So you need that, all right? Because not all the times you're gonna be um, using the dog. So if you shot an animal, this is very good um, for finding that animal, okay? Because sometimes while hunting diamonds, you wanna leave your dog because your dog might spook um, the animal, okay? Now this is the most important one, soft feet. Now you want to have two points on soft feet, okay? Level 1 reduces the noise generated when moving through foliage such as grass and leaves. Level 2 reduces the noise generated when moving through large vegetation such as bushes and shrubs. So you really need to have both points on this because this is one of the skills that will help you to be able to sneak up on animals real quick okay now this one is a 
weather prediction I, I i don't know what this is for if any of you guys use this skill leave a comment in the comment section and tell me how this skill works out for you i've never used it before so i can't give uh, uh, uh explanation on that one all right now